This is the White House, home of the American president. If you were extremely wealthy and your father or husband was president, you might like to have a go too. This has been an historic day, Prime Minister. It certainly has, Mr. President. I'm sure this treaty will bring harmony between China and the West. I do hope so, darling. I'm sorry, Mr. President. Come in. Ah, yes. I've asked my secretary to frame a photo of us all to commemorate this day. Oh, thank you. <laughs> it's a shame about her, but oh, it's a nice one of us, yeah. Well, I'm sure you don't want to keep your jet waiting. I'll see you next month at the summit. I've got a present for you. Oh, what is it? Close your eyes. What are you... What are... You can open your eyes now, Mr. President. It's a diamond necklace. You look beautiful. Right. I wanted to give you a pearl necklace. Really? I thought that one was nicer. <laughs> I got you the earrings, too. No. But they go with the necklace. No, thank you. Look, they're gorge. Look, this is ridiculous. Would you help me get this damn thing off? <laughs> Mr. President, Prime Minister, I just came to say goodbye. Yes, goodbye, President Young. Yeah, goodbye, dear. I want to thank the Chinese Communist Party. On behalf of the People's Republic of China, I thank you. They look like a pair of fruits. <laughs> oh no, don't translate that bit. <laughs>